guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for to episode 7 and 8 of Jobless Reincarnation. This is going to get started episode 7 and 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, okay. Shit, that is... Damn! Nice block, though. Nice. <laughs> this fucking bitch. Oh my God. <laughs> It could be just because. Mm. Yeah. <gasps> ah! Hell, I mix Roxy too. Oh my god, you little perv! Are, are you sure about that, Rudy? Bunny teeth, oh my god, that was cute. <laughs> Ooh. 
Bro, we got two different Phillips. We got Jobless Reincarnation Philip, and we got Overlord Philip. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you fall, oh damn. I mean, well, he barely saw anything, he more or less heard. <laughs> well, why don't you have Rudy help? I mean, I don't think Rudy is the best at dancing either. Oh, and I'm not even at work. Hush. <laughs> oh, damn. She is kicking your ass every single week. No. Well, I mean, because if you're I mean, one, you have to. Oh. You know you want to, so just say, yeah. <laughs> Come on, you're going to. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ oh huh. I mean like she's really really bad like oh shit And I think because it is, is so bad, it's because she wants to lead in the dance, but... There you go.
damn, that's a big ass box. Oh God. <laughs> Another letter. Mm -hmm. Girl, you still with the same damn kid? Oh my. Oh, that fat kid about to come. Oh, Jesus, here he come. Here he comes. You still gonna try? <laughs> oh God. Ew. Right, I never would have thought. Ew. <laughs> hey, I, but there are some guys who like feet. I, I don't understand, but whatever floats your boat. too oh god this is like just for her i mean not only a birthday but into society and class and everything this is her one freaking shot and if she messes it up <laughs> oh she looks so cute She should be okay. Ooh. Oh! Okay, I thought that was a punch or a slap. I'm scared.
Oh, fuck. Well, she can only do it with him. I know, right? Like... <laughs> Just take your time. There you go. Oh, shit. Oh. Well, of course she is. Okay. Keep your eyes closed. that height though. <laughs> it's cute. You just can't ship it though. They're good. Fuck it, I collab. <laughs> there you go. Finally, like oh my god. Get jealous of him? That's your cousin! Oh, baby! Oh, God, I hope he's here soon. It feels like it's been years. <laughs> Right? 
Right. Well, yeah, because, you know, us girls, we like jewelry. And so jewelry is always going to win over a wand. I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> so much sick and Please don't, you little perv. <laughs> what well, damn? <laughs> like hella early in the morning, Jesus. episode focusing on her and her birthday episode i thought that was cute adorable sweet even though in a way rudy stole the show i mean this is his series so of course he's gonna have a lot more moments on him rather than like everyone else but it was sweet love that roxy made a book for him like oh uh, like so once again we're getting the moments between these two and it just makes me even more excited when we do get to see these two meet up again like it's just gonna feel right and i'm gonna feel so freaking happy and ecstatic when they're together again um what else do i want to say okay the dance between rudy and it is that was sweet i i love the fact that you know he told her close your eyes this is the only way this is gonna help and she was able to rock it. Because, like, yeah, I, I think all of us were probably really scared for this child. Because, once again, I, as someone who has watched shows where it is a, a young child um, getting uh, coming to a certain age and they're making their debut into social society and usually it is a ball or something-esque party for them. And they're now, all these grand people from these families are coming to meet them and get to see the first introduction of her or him into society. Yeah, there's a lot of pressure on it. And the fact that she had to do a dance and dance with several other guys, or really what I like to say is gentlemen, um, for this, it is a lot of pressure for a little girl. I mean, hey, she's only fucking 10. But... So, like I, I just knew once that dancing part started the little freaking practice I was like she's gonna mess up she is gonna mess it up and she is gonna eat and, and so many people are gonna talk about this but once again Rudy came in like guns blazing saving the day stealing the show as always but like oh like even the fact that he gave both of them like wands you know, passing it down because, you know, Roxy gave him something. Like, that was so sweet. I really now want to see, like, either Ares or What's-Her-Face, like, now take someone under their wing and then, like, continue on the legacy and such. Um, Roxy's little shit that she babysit. Fuck him. <laughs> I don't like him. I, I, I haven't liked him ever since he popped into the series. And then, like, because uh, did, did we really have to show him licking the figure? Like, really? 
Ew, that was so nasty. <laughs> child <laughs> like you know burn it oh god uh-uh <laughs> but um yeah very interesting episode got a little bit of questions about that ending and such and what is gonna happen but mm, of course we gotta wait until the next episode but go ahead and pause the video and i will see you guys in one second for episode eight all right episode eight and three two one, go. Hmm? Nice. Such a twelve now. Mm -hmm. Right? Because, like, I mean, let's go back into the end of the previous episode. It looked like it was getting not closer, but now looking at it, yeah, maybe because <laughs> something about that. Mm -mm. Tomorrow is Thursday. Tomorrow is double the first time I played. So, hmm. Should I? Of course, because it's your birthday. Congrats. Oh, 
Nope, can't do that. No, no, no. <laughs> mm hmm. Did you make a figure of her? Yeah. <laughs> I have a bad feeling about this. Oh my god. Wait. This is gonna be like that one clip. <laughs> I'm good. No. Seriously? My chip got buns of steel. Oh. Damn, I would have really liked to see this family because it's been a while. Oh! Yeah, I thought she hated you as well! I understand age has nothing to do with it, but hold on. Y'all still family? No! <laughs> no! Stop. Was this staff in the season two trailer? Oh, it's beautiful. Right. How you could sell that bad boy if you really wanted to, but you know, A, it's your birthday, keep it. Yeah, please talk some sense to your grandfather and your mom. Cause... <laughs> oh, God.
so that's why. No. Oh my god. Of course he is, but j just say no. No. Thank you. Good boy. Mm, good boy. I still don't trust him. You don't have to. Oh, my God. Oh my god. She looks so precious like that. Like, oh, just, mm-mm. No. You did. Mm
and, and she'll be 17. <laughs> Her baby. Hmm, dang, you almost made me think that was outside. It's like I'm like, damn, what's well, supposed to rain today for us? Who is that? Oh, damn. Ma'am, you're in this too? Oh my god.
I don't think this episode's gonna end in a good ending this week. Holy. Uh oh. Go home. No, go home. Go home. Yes. Mm-hmm. It, it, that one hero that we talked about, like, from last week's episodes, so six and seven, not six and seven, five and six. There's no freaking way y'all can outrun that! Mm -hmm. You would end it like that. You would fucking end that shit like that. You fucking would. You fucking would. <laughs> okay, hold up. Time out on everything. How the fuck are you expecting me to wait till next week? You know what? Look, look, Kissy, let's just go ahead and say this. We all know, as I said in the Review Starlight video, and then from what I've been talking about in other videos, Okay, coming out possibly tomorrow and Friday night. Next week is my hell week. Um, so I'm gonna be busy every single fucking day because I gotta work. I gotta work six days next week. Um, and I'm not. I'm really dreading it. I don't even want to go to next week. Okay, I I literally cannot wait. It, it's a good thing that I'm gonna try to watch the next two episodes and the Review Starlight movie at least between tomorrow and Friday night. What the fuck was that ending? What the. Okay, that's one. Two. Number three. Y'all yeah, yeah, really had to, oh my god. They had to have him in this show. I just watched him in Rub You Starlight as a giraffe. Had not heard this man as the damn giraffe in almost like, what, three years, I believe, when I watched Rub You Starlight. Oh god, it just. He's got to play a hot mofo, like the daddy of all daddies. Like, again, daddy of all daddies. Like, it's like, yes! <laughs> Here you go, DJ. Here's a hot anime man. <laughs> oh my god, I can't. What the fuck is happening? I'm scared. Okay, like, in that last moment, like, when Rudy was like, okay, and it's like, come on, let's go. And the fact is that she, um, she stood there for like a moment and then she just went to the floor because yeah, I understand because in that same moment, it's like, 
something is coming towards you. You know in your heart, physically, e mentally, emotionally, you cannot outrun that. There is no way in hell that they could have outrun that. So she's like, you know what? That's it. There's nothing else I can do. We're, we're just letting it end right here and there, you know? But, okay, so what the heck is beyond the light? Y'all want to go ahead and tell me so I... <laughs> So I had to wait a week, but I mean, I'm going to find out between tomorrow and Friday. Um, but damn, like th this episode really went by quick, fast in a hurry to the point where I was like, oh shit, we're done. We're done for th for today. Like Jesus Christ. Like, oh, that's like yesterday's episode of, um, when's not Wednesday cause today is Wednesday, Tuesday's episode of Overlord. It went by so fast. And the next thing you know, I was like, the episode's over. I'm like. That felt like five minutes. Like, wh what did we do the whole entire time? <laughs> and that's what this felt like. It just felt like five minutes. Not even five. It felt like two, three, three, two minutes, maybe even five. But like, it just went by so freaking quick that we're at the end and <sighs> you give me a cliffhanger. And I don't like cliffhangers like that though. But okay. I'm going to have to, like, definitely go and look at the season two trailer again because I think that it's the same staff that he currently has as of right now because we all know he's okay because the trailer and such. But what the fuck is beyond that light? That's all I want to know. Is Ares and What's-Her-Face, are they okay? Because I don't think from that season two trailer they're nowhere to be found. So, of course, they got to be okay. But definitely won't know until I watch... Um, nine and ten whether it is tomorrow or friday but yeah these both were damn good episodes like ooh, this was like even better also yes yeah, to see sophie let's go baby oh my god and then like seeing the rest of his family oh my god and the kids that are growing up uh even though yes i'm still a little, i'm like <sighs> see this is once again i'm torn with paul because it's like oh my god yes like got a crush on him but at the same time because of what the fuck he did and how I'm a type of person um, who doesn't really con doesn't really like cheating and stuff. And of course, yeah, like, I'm like this. I'm like, I like it, but I want to beat the shit out of you. Yeah. <laughs> like, ah. But I, I just, oh, God, I really do wish that, yes, his family got to be with him on his birthday. Because that's what any kid would truly want is to spend time with their family as yes. Even if you're spending time with your extended family, but when it's your family that you've grown with, like, of course. Even the fact is that freaking it is wrong when I want her and Rudy to get married. But what? What? They're cousins. What the fuck are you talking about? Like, you know, I thought Game of Thrones was, was crazy with the ish that they did when I was watching that show and when I finished it and I was just like, yeah, that happened. <laughs> like, <laughs> just, you know, no, because when I sit, think about it, I'm thinking, like, all the crazy shit that happened in Game of Thrones, and then I look at something like this, and I'm like, yeah, Game of Thrones is child's play now. So, <laughs> just like, oh, I, I fucking can't. But other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode seven and eight of Jobless Reincarnation. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, uh, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for Patreons and next Wednesday for everybody else for episodes 9 and 10. Once again, as I said, when we get into next week, aka Hell Week, it is going to be nonstop. Like, I'm going to be coming home dead ass tired. So, just in case. Because I'm probably going to be putting this on uh, Monday Monday morning or whatever. I'll probably make a post tonight. Just in case some things happen. Just uh, ultimately, if this gets postponed really for episodes 9 and 10 and the next review Starlight movie, just know that is the reason why. Because I know I'm going to be deadbeat tired next week to the point where I'm going to come home and I'll be like, I, wanna, I just want to be left alone. I don't want to do nothing. But I'm going to try to power through and try to get everything done. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.